jump straight into the video so let's go ahead and get started okay so what you want to do is go over here to create a design and once you go to create a design and this would be a flyer <coughs> tutorial and i'm basically recreating one of my viral videos which was which was the first video that i uploaded on youtube so yes go over here to instagram post or you can just type in 1080 by 1080 pixels template has loaded and the first thing i want to do is go up here and type in uh let's just say book now flyer so we can just type that in and you can name it whatever you want tonight <clears throat> if you was doing something else but just in case your files get lost you may want to go ahead and just name that design okay so now i want to go and get my background so here is the background that i want to use and what i'm going to do here is just stretch it out just like this but the thing is i don't want it as dark as it as dark as it is so i'm gonna take and move this over or you can either well let me show you first you can either change the background to black which i'm about to show you so you can change it to black like this because i'm because it's a certain look that i'm going for so i'm going to show you the first one and because i don't want too much of the, um, the highlight showing so that's basically why i put the black background right there and now i'm going to go to the transparency and just take it down just like that and if you was to like remove that um the black background and change it to something else this is basically how it would look and it wouldn't look right so that's basically why i changed the background to black like this to, for it to give me this look or if you want to you could like let's say you take the transparency up the background will even matter anymore <clears throat> Because you're not, you're not taking the transparency down. So what you can do is go over here to elements. And click, go to the shapes and click on that square. Once that square pop up, you don't leave it that color. What you can do is go over here to the colors itself. So you go to color. And you just click click on black. But this is another way of how you could do it. Just stretching it out so that it fits around. It don't have to be perfect at all so i got that on top of the background that i want to use as you can see and now i'm gonna go to transparency and i could just take it down just like this as you can see so yeah that is another way how you can do it but i don't want to do it that way so i'm just delete that and take the transparency down like this and i can move it up or down so I'm basically just playing around with it. Okay, so now that I have my background to how I want it to be, I want to go and grab the cell phone. Yeah, the cell phone element be changing like the picture that I have for it. Okay, what I'm gonna do is go over here to elements and I'm just type in phone. So let's just type in phone. And I'm gonna just go ahead and just pick that one since, since it was the first one that I saw. Um, okay, and now because with the first flyer that I did, it was like a Polaroid, if I'm not mistaken. It was a Polaroid, so I think I may want to do it like this. And okay, so I got the phone now. I want to go and grab the picture that I want to use because it's going to be a nail, I mean, a nail flyer. Here is the picture that I want to use now. I just have to get it inside of that phone frame and if i sound different it's because i'm using blue d headphones and i absolutely love it and if you want these to do your content or just listen to music or whatever purpose that you may have i will have the link down below so you can go and purchase them and they are currently on sale at this moment and like i said i love them but let me know down in the comments on how do y'all like this sound better do y'all like me using using the headphones or do y'all not like me using the headphones which one sounds better to y'all from this video and compared to my other videos so yeah now i went to border style and i'm just taking and rounding the corners so as you can see if i don't round the corners it just give it that sharp edge and that, that i don't want so i'm just basically curving it or rounding it as they have up here so what i can do now is go ahead and position it to the back just like that and if you don't like how everything is placed so what i'm going to do is just 
So say if I want something, I'm going to just double click. Once I double click, this right here will pop up. So you can basically drag it wherever you want it to be. So I wanted more of this to show. And I can drag that down. Okay, so I think that right there would be good enough. Now I can just take my phone and place it right back over it. Okay, just like that. And now I want to go and grab another, well, go and grab my square shape. And I'm going to exit out of this and grab that shape again. And with this, just take this down. Let me lock this in place so I can like, basically move this around. Okay, so that right there would be good enough. Now I want to go and grab my text, my appointment. No, I need to put appointments. Appointments because there will be more than one available. Now I'm going to take that and just write available. I don't know if they want to do right. I don't know how that got up there, but so right here, we're just going to put available. And out of that, we're going to just, because I'm going to put like book now right here. And I'm going to put it in all caps. Book now, make another copy. And this is the fastest way to try and get a flyer done. I promise. And right here, it's going to be 000. Let me put the parentheses. No. Let's try this again because it done disappeared on me. Okay. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. So 000. zero, zero. Dash zero zero zero, and we're just gonna pretend as it's a number. It is a number, but it's not a real number. Now I want to go and add another, and this one just basically going to say social media. My bad, y'all. Social media. Now put your social media. So let's just put your social media. And the great thing is, I don't even have to type this again. Just make a copy. Easy peasy, easy peasy. And down here, I can just simply just type in your oops, website.com. Easy, easy, easy. Now, I have all of my text out of the way. I'm going to change this one down here to the actual black. Change to the anti font. So, let me go and get that. I just went with this one, Coluna. Hopefully, I'm pronouncing it right. But if not, oh well. So I have this, and I'm trying to make the placement of where I want it to be. Okay, I think that right there would be good. And this one, I'm going to change it to that same font right there. Now I want to make the text bigger. Make it go, go like right here. And this one, I'm undecided. You know what, I'm going to just make it in all caps, and let's just see. Let's just see how this going to get when I be going to this. So let's just see how this looks. And again, I'm just recreating my first video that I uploaded on YouTube. I thought it was a great idea to do so. So that's basically why I'm doing it. Especially my first video and it went viral. Of course, I'm recreating it. And now I have that. I want to... I think I could like bring this up a tad bit and even make it a little bigger. You know what? I'm gonna make it smaller. We're gonna make it smaller. Now we just gonna make it smaller. And I just wanna take these texts and just bring them up here. And now I'm going to go back to, you know, I don't even have to do all that. I just could go and grab this. Easy peasy. But before I do, I do that, I wanna make this text down here bold. Oh, which was already bold, so I can now, let's see if I was to like space it out, how would it look? Should I space it out? Hmm, I don't know. But let's just see. Okay, I think we can, we can do it. So I'm going to just keep it as is. And now with this, I'm going to just position it to the back. 
another copy and just bring that one down here under this one. Bring that one down and now I can just go ahead and position them to the back. So I'm going to zoom in and I'm going to get them placed like this. I'm going to change the, the font color to black. And then we're going to see how it's looking. Oops, I hit white. Okay. So let's see. Okay, okay. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. Um, sorry, I keep playing around with this to see <laughs> what looks better. And I want to actually change. I think I'm going to keep it pink. And I'm going to change this one to the color pink also. First flyer that I did. I added like some hearts down here. So I'm just going to grab them same hearts, okay? Here are the hearts that I used for the other um, video that I did. And I'm going to just change it. Let's see how it looks with pink first. Okay, so this is how it looks with pink. I think too much pink is up here. So I'm going to just go ahead and change it to white. Okay, and there we have it. And you can also like add your icons to this. But I'm not going to do that. Because I wanted a somewhat different look. So yes, this is the flyer design. Let me know which one y'all love better. This one or the first video that I ever uploaded on YouTube. Which is one of my most viral videos. So y'all let me know which one y'all like better. And again, thank y'all for watching. If you have watched this far, subscribe if you're new here. Go ahead and like this video. Share it with your family, your friends, all of your social media. I would truly appreciate it. And thank you again for watching. God bless.